tao la. Ubusep <laughs> yo. Okay, I was gonna do love readings, but I didn't realize that I've already did love readings. So we're going to do career finance. Or maybe general. So we're gonna start with source and see what they're giving. I'm not gonna do a stone. I'm gonna just go. So spirit, let's get into it. Let's get into it. We're gonna start with Taurus. Taurus career reading for September. Spirit, please give me clear, concise messages. Hello, for my Taurus for September. All right, clear my energy. I burned some sage. I burned some polycentos earlier. I love my polycentos. If y'all know, you know. If you don't, stay tuned. Okay. So let's get into it. Source. We can have quick and safe messages for my source in, in career. I lied. Okay, let's get into it again. Okay, so Spirit, please give me clear, concise messages for my Taurus for September. September's Taurus career reading finances. Okay, Spirit, can I please have clear, concise messages for my Taurus for career? Okay. How are y'all doing today? Okay, this has been the overall the overall energy for my sources for a while. Okay. Um I feel like it's you in your own way. I feel like it's this has been probably for the past couple months for my source this has been in love this has been in just y'all like overall energy and it feels like um this is for everybody really i always say this too like it's um spirit can have click and sex messages for my source um it's really like a um it's like a personality check for you guys okay it's funny because I'm doing Taurus. I put full moon in Taurus, Leo, Leo. Have Leo energy and have Taurus. Um, have Leo. A lot of Leo energy. Like, I gotta sneeze. Okay, I feel like you all. Hello, how you doing? I feel like for my Taurus, as far as your key to success because <laughs> like i said i'm doing y'all success reading now for like confidence is the key to your success okay so i feel like this is you guys need to like first of all y'all need to figure out what it is that y'all want to do you guys might be um you all might say like oh i want to do that like you have a lot that y'all want to do like that y'all saying that y'all want to do but y'all not doing it it's a whole, like, talk is cheap. So it's time for you all to plant the seed. Like, I feel like you keep planting a lot of seeds in different areas of your life. In different, different areas. I feel like y'all doing a lot of talking. Like, talk is cheap. Y'all doing a whole bunch of talking. and Or, like, you all are, like, so, I'm sorry, y'all be rambling. So, they say whoever they is like before you like start a business venture or when you're starting one you shouldn't let everyone know what you're about to do before you do it because if you're letting everybody know what you're what you're gonna do before you do it what you're doing is 
you're allowing the enemy or people to intrude on your energy so you're allowing people to place their doubts or their hate and all of that onto you okay now everyone has your best intentions everybody does not want to see you win okay everybody don't want to see you win so until you got things up in motion even sometimes when you do have it up in motion like everybody doesn't know need to know how you got to where you are you know and and in life it's not about you like oh oh um you're trying to hold people back from um like oh you don't want to see anybody else win or stuff like that yeah because like i feel like you guys do have the key to success like you have the ideas um you have all the resources and things like that that you need but the thing about it is it's another theme for you guys towards you is you, the company that you're keeping is not good you need to step out of your old ways and your your circle your old circle and the things that you're used to doing like you can't keep saying oh you want to be a better person you want to be a different person oh you want to like you want to be a millionaire but you keep hanging around with people who are, who are not millionaires or or not on the road to success you know or like like you're hanging i feel like you're hanging around like-minded individuals that are like you you get what i'm saying but your destiny is meant to be greater like you're destined to be greater but you're hanging with people who are on a mediocre level you're not mediocre but your behavior is very mediocre so that's what you're attracting okay like like a spirit wants to bless you I'm not saying that they don't bless you I'm not saying it like that we're talking about what we're talking about okay yeah like you like you just need to watch your circle and watch where you're playing your seed like say if you're like oh I want to move to a better neighbor I, I want my kids to grow up in a better environment I want my kids not to be around um violence and crime and stuff like that but you move out of one project into the next projects you know that's not the way to do it okay so um what i have to say or spirit or whatever you want whatever like for you to be your sister because this is a boss this is your boss mentality and look look who we have other it's the taurus <laughs> my taurus got my taurus horns out i think yeah yeah that's my source like so what i have to say is like before you plant your seeds or while you're planting your seeds because you have greatness that wants to come in you have wealth and money that's waiting for you and that's ready for you and all this set all of this success you've been trying to plant your ideas but you've been planting your seeds in bad soil so what I have to say to you is plant your seeds in a in a in a better environment, in a better environment where you know it's gonna be water, where you know it's gonna be love, where you know, you know, you're gonna get you know, a successful outcome. You know? Like but everything is is bad and good, okay? So you can say, oh, I want to be a. I want to have. I want to have my own bar, right? Or my own club. You can have a nice, successful club, but you got to think about where you want to open the club at. If you open it a block away from the projects, like, oh, it's a chance that it might, and the audience that you're uh, going out or promoting to is ratchet. So it's going to be bad. But that's not saying that you can't have a successful club. Excuse me. That's nasty. It's not saying that you can have a, a successful club or a successful business. It's it's where you build your business. Where are you building your business? Where are you planning your ideas? Who are the people that's around you? Who are you sharing your business adventures? Who are you know what I'm saying? So for the most part, I mean, overall, my 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 jewel for you guys is watch the company you keep in. Um. 
stop talking so much. I feel like it's a lot of talking. Y'all talk a lot. Y'all talk a lot to the wrong people. Okay? You talk about things before they're happening. Um, another thing with talking, you, you do a lot of talking and not enough action. You have to, you need, everything is in steps. You can't just wake up and be a millionaire. I don't care if you want to say you're a master manifester, but you, your goals need a plan, you know? So that's my messages for my tours. I hope it resonated. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching my video. And um, comment below and let me know what you think, okay? And subscribe. Did I say that?